there was an interview with Yoshi P, the game's director, back in August. And I'm taking this from Video Games Chronicle by Chris uh, Scullion. And in this interview, Yoshi P says, in quote, we want the world, especially the younger generation, to play the game. It is also a fact that people are becoming less familiar with the old fashioned style of RPGs where you fight by selecting turn commands. That's why the battles in Final Fantasy 16 are very action based. This is not an argument of what's good or bad, but there is a difference based on the player's preferences and age. When I read this interview, I got the impression that he is apologizing for the gameplay of a game that has not been released and no one has tried yet. And that's where I started getting negative vibes. The story seems very good. It's warring nations, kind of like Game of Thrones. You can see the crystals that each nation has, that they're like mountains. They're plotting against each other for what we'll, I guess we'll find out when we play the game. And, you know, it seems very interesting, but I go in the back of my mind is this interview where he's apologizing about the combat. And it's just, I just, I don't know. I have a bad feeling about it. I think the confidence in his statements are what's making me not feel so confident in the game itself. He says he's aware that the game won't appeal to everyone. If I was a producer, I would say this is the best game ever made. It's going to be a classic. If you don't like it, something's wrong with you. <laughs> and all I'm seeing is kind of like apologies almost saying, hey, you know, I know it's not going to everyone. I know everyone's not going to like it, but, you know, guys, it's going to be good. Trust me, it's going to be good. You don't even believe in yourself right now, so there's nothing that's going to make me feel more confident. I will say, from the previous previews, the battle system looked amazing. It was like a more action-oriented combat, and it, it, it gave me a lot of uh, Tales of Arise vibes, which is really more of an action combat RPG where when you go into battles, you go into like a battle arena and you fight the monsters doing combos and uh, special attacks. But then they showed this story trailer and, and that looked good too, but it, I don't know how it's going to mesh together. What do you guys think? I think you brought up a great point, please, uh, about uh, that they know that they're not going to appeal to the old school Final Fantasy fans. But at the same time, why are you making the setting then the classic Final Fantasy. It, that's what looks great about it to me. It has the medieval setting. It's back to crystals. The characters are knights instead of a bunch of emo boy band guys wearing all black leather. <laughs> you know, it looks classic. Old school fans loved the turn-based games. Of course. Of the and old still, Final I still Fantasy. love it. Correct. But they can't make a turn-based game right now as a mainland Final Fantasy and expect it to sell. The Final Fantasy VII Remake has the perfect balance of the turn-based and action combat already. It's the best of both worlds mixed together. I played that game, and it's, it's fantastic. And they could have done what they used to do with Final Fantasy, update the battle systems for each game to make slight modifications, but once they got the active term, the active time battle, that's what it was with modifications. I don't understand why mm -hmm. they switching to the all action. It seems like, uh, I don't know. And they're even saying it themselves. They're apologizing for it before anyone's <laughs> even played it. It's crazy. Like, I know they're going to hate this. If you liked our content, mash that like button. And if you're new to the channel and want to see more content, Hit the subscribe button. Thanks for watching.